happy Mother's Day weekend. And by the end of it, I was like, oh my God, is he mansplaining to me? And <laughs> Because this is not, this is just no way to live. This is no way to live. This is a great demo, they just see my back. <laughs> you have no idea what's going on. And hello everybody, it is Dingle here and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing super, super, duper well and happy Mother's Day weekend to all the US moms out there, including us fur baby moms, of course. We are actually just getting all packed up because we're heading up, obviously, to my parents' house for Mother's Day. We just got back from Market Basket and we got a beautiful little basket of flowers that Jack and I picked out and then also we wanted to cook my mom Jack's legendary wings. It's insane. So thankfully we were able to secure some wings. Apparently there's a wing shortage in the US right now and I'm confused about it. But even if there's not a wing shortage, sometimes we can't find the correct wings. But the wings that you want, oh, I can't even show you, but they're literally like very specific. They're called party wings. They're not full drumsticks. They're not like the full chicken wings. They literally say chicken party wings. And they're just like the variety with the flats and like the rounds and stuff like that. And if you get the other ones, there's not like a variety of them, if that makes sense. So we have those specific wings. And then to make Jack's legendary wings, the amount of spices when he was pulling out all these spices I was actually shocked like I was like I had no idea that this much went into making your wings and this is why they say what are you saying puppy I can't put that in oh okay <laughs> okay I like to add flavor okay yes you like to add flavor and then we've got our overnight bag do you have your overnight bag yes yeah, right there all Sorry. packed up okay yeah. what are you thinking about? I can't take credit for this guys Mac will put the Recipe in the description below. Yeah, but like anyone really can mine. follow a recipe except you make it really really freaking good I've made it my own too. Like I it's so good. I'll right. know how picky I am about uh, My the meat that I consume and how I don't eat a lot of chicken at all these chicken wings I've asked for before they're yeah, kind of nuts. So good. I can't even get over it. Okay Two days in a row too. So good like I can't they're so good. Okay, let me just run through my pack my list I've got my toiletries. Okay which is like, I've got my lotion, she has Charger. face wash there. I've, I don't have any chargers, I usually don't like bring okay. them. Cinnamon, I've got Tylenol, we've got the sound machine, I've got an extra pair of clothes for tomorrow, and I think I'm good. Sweet. Yeah, I think we're all set and ready to jet. I think we're good, man. Cool, let's get in the car and show them the flowers. Right. As here is the basket of flowers. Isn't it literally the cutest thing you've ever seen in your entire life? I'm obsessed with it. And then we also have dad's computer that we've had for so long that I went to pick up the other week. Got my bag, water, check. We Gucci, putting on the Bunny 2.0 playlist. I have to do now. <laughs> but guys, this is my Spotify playlist that Jack made me a while ago. And he keeps taking off songs that are really old and adding songs that I really like. Adding current bops. The current bops, always thinking of me. We're on our way. We're on our way. Dun, 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 dun. I belong, I belong to you. Listen to all the birds, guys. I don't know if you can hear them, but they are loud. Spring is sprung, bub. What? <laughs> the flying rats. You're already an old angry geezer. <laughs> Piloted woodpecker. But actually, where is it? It's up here. It's up there somewhere. There you where? So in the middle branch. Oh my gosh, I do see him. Zoom in on that shit. Look at him go. I don't know if y'all can see him, but he's right there. I don't think it's pilot. I don't know what a pilot is. Woodpecker. You keep saying, "Look at the woodpecker." Oh, I see. I see. Come on, Hi, mom. You see it? See the pilot woodpecker. An effing pilot woodpecker. Hi, baby. Hi, sweetie. Do not go in there. Give your mother her flowers. Oh, okay. Hey, Mama D. Yeah. We got you fresh cut. Flowers. No way! Yeah. From where? From market, market basket. basket. That's perfect! 
Happy Mother's Happy Day. Mother's. Oh, look, I got fresh cut flowers. Flowers. <laughs> Hi, Benny. <laughs> Poor place. Oh. 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 oh, Blaze. Hello, Benny. Is that all her hair? You just started. <laughs> Not even half. Oh my gosh, Blaze! Your your spring coat is everywhere. Look at her. Oh my gosh. Hi, baby. Hi, Dad. Hello. Hi. Yeah, totally. I I came to drop off your laptop, and then we're gonna go back. Yeah. Oh, all these trees? Those two right there. Oh my gosh, there's so many trees. <laughs> Mom is just Mom's just preparing to cave herself in to the new people who are doing construction over there. She's just blocking. She's building her wall. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and a moat. <laughs> Literally, no one is seeing into this yard. <laughs> Tell me you like your privacy without telling me you like, like your, your privacy. <laughs> Right there. Oh, I love it. You got Brussels. And no, I'm, you guys like them, right? I love Brussels. I thought, like, I thought Brussels were We were almost, inside. well, the, what we had Brussels with the wings with ginger, which is funny, and we didn't tell, yeah, I didn't even say that. We got Brussels, which I thought we could figure out how to make, and then, um, the honey roasted potatoes. Oh, Ooh, honey roasted potatoes. Yeah. Guys, it's gonna be so good. Make your cookies. <gasps> cookies! Yeah, did you get the milk bar? Well, I was like, what? I wanted it to come on Friday, but it came a day early. It's so that that was from, did you see who it was from? I No. Did you see who it was from? No, I, I opened it without my glass and then they put it away, right? You put it, you put it away. Okay, right good. There? Ben, just don't look at it. Okay. Just don't look well, at it. Well, I don't know if it says anything. I didn't put it away in the box. I took it out. Oh, okay. So Interesting. Well, know. well, it was from, it was from us. Sam, Gabe, Cat, Miss Ally, Hippo, oh, the, whole the whole gang. Very nice. So that's for that's a that's for the celebration. Awesome. I do have a, a couple of chocolate chip cookies in advance if you need cookies. Yes, I have some. I'm a little munchy. Are you? Yeah. Well, I also have some um, briat. Oh, then I will have and, some um, briat okay. and things like that too. So right. that sounds good. You did do something. Just walking down like cream. What do you do? If you can pull this off now. Yeah, it's just caught on the cream. If you promise you, not to no, do well, it. No, no, over here, Mac. Just yeah. knock that cream over. Oh, oh I see. Yeah, there you I'll go. get yeah, this yeah. side. Yeah, right. Push it down. There's, no. a, certain, there's a certain time for brute force. Oh, I got it. <laughs> there was, it was loose already. I helped you. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I loosened it. Okay, Dad. Granulated sugar. Oh, yeah. Yes. Ground sugar. Oh, no, we don't need to do it yet. Okay. Because we can't start until those come out and start to cool. Roger. Brown sugar. Then I'll get an egg. I have my vanilla extract. I'll get my flour. I have hot baking powder, baking soda, kosher salt, mini chocolate chips, for mini marshmallows. Yes. Oh, yeah. no, I bought them for you guys. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, that would be sad. All the flavors. All the flavors. So Gabe, Gabe had another presentation this week. Oh, oh man. man. And it went well. Oh, so man. Said, um, very good. Um, and wow, you're really good at presenting. Yeah, he is a good presenter. So that was good. You felt good about that. Dad, you didn't Sam cheers has me. Huh? You cheers me. Sweet. Cheers. It's good. Yeah. It's the most reluctant oh, cheers I've ever seen in my life. Guys, the wine has come out. Oh, yeah, this. Hold on. Which one? What's that one? The cab. Yeah. 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 So you, 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 right you can totally tell the right? Wait, I want to try. Right. Which one? Do you remember Pino? which one's which? Pino cab. Okay. Pino. 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 You did. Right there. There. Okay. Oh. You can tell because this one says Hallelujah <laughs> when it touches your lips. This one right here. Life is a winding road. No telling where it goes. Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down 
down I will Go keep on searching for Go. my highs What you been through? God, you can <laughs> say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head Hi there, can I get a medium cold brew with three milks and three butter pecans and then another medium cold brew black and that'll do it Thank you. Thank you. Guys, we've never tried butter pecan before in our entire lives. Literally in our entire lives. From Duncan. Thursday's gonna be 64 and something. 64 this week? Yeah. Oh my gosh. That was wow, not supposed wow. to happen. 61, 61, 63, 64, <gasps> 64. That's all this week? End of the week. Into oh, next yeah. week. See, like this Thursday into Thursday is supposed to be 60s. Oh, uh, I, I need some some more some more 60 degree weather is up in here. Mind if I call my mom in the car? You call. Yes, I mind if you call your mother on Mother's Day. I knew that you would. Farm. I knew it! I posted for Mother's Day on Instagram. It was a TikTok, so I did reels. So I posted it when I had just a little bit of service on our way back. When I opened it, when I got back to service, because there's like this weird dead spot on the highway in between here and my parents' house. And so when I got back to service, I was like, darn, that's like a lot of a lot of likes for like the time it's been up what the heck and it literally I, there was a notification it had like over a thousand views already i was like oh it's happening it went somewhere so funny when that stuff happens what's so interesting it's interesting because tiktok has a great algorithm like everyone loves their algorithm it can take off at any time we've had a couple tiktoks do that which is really exciting but instagram reels seems to have that also but it's Instagram, and Instagram's algorithm is known to just suck <laughs> a little bit. So it's interesting that like they might have a separate algorithm when it comes to their Reels feature. Yeah, I wonder. Well, it's all Facebook. Nobody understands Facebook. No one understands Facebook and Instagram. I watched the funniest TikTok last night. Is that the one you sent to me last night? I think so, with the mansplaining. Did you watch that? No, I watched one, um, I saw that you sent a cat one, oh. like a separation anxiety one. Oh yeah. And oh. I saw the cat and they were, she was like purring and stuff. So cute. No, the mansplaining was like, it was like, tell me the worst mansplaining experience you've had without telling me the worst mansplaining. And then he stitched and he goes, you know, just in case you all didn't understand what she was saying, what she wants you to do is stitch it with this video. I don't think it came across. So just in case it didn't come yeah, across very clear. Understand. And then he, he mansplained what mansplaining was. Since of a guy who is trying to explain something to you that you already understand, but he's not sure if you understand. So he's gonna explain it to you. And I think that's what she wants you to do in this video. So anyway, <laughs> just, and by the end of it, I was like, oh my God, is he mansplaining to me? And I literally, I literally laughed. I was like, oh my gosh, the genius on this guy. He, like, I wasn't even aware of it until... He yeah. was hysterical. Like, someone, yeah. I, I saw the comment, and it was like, this is the best form of satire I've ever seen. Yeah. Like, he performed it so well. It was on fire. Alrighty. Is that Thank a you. kuwata behind her? It is. I didn't even know they still had kuwatas. They do. Awesome. Thank you so much. You too. Alright, butter pecan guys. Do you guys say pecan or pecan? Butter penis. <laughs> say pecan. You say pecan. Like a pecan. I like say a butter pecan. Pe I think I I think I combine them. I say butter pecan. <laughs> I say pecan and oh I don't butter pecan. I don't know what I say. So, Ooh. Do we love it or no? Worth all those Instagram comments. Yeah, so, hold on, I'm getting my mind wrapped around it right now. You'll love this. Oh, sorry, the only you will love it. this and you'll understand why. Yes. Yeah, that's really good. I knew it. It's almost hazelnutty without being there hazelnut. It reminds me of like a nutty, hazily nutty taste. Which it's is almost like a pecan nut. Almost like a pecan, like a toucan. I like it though. Um, I just knew you would really like it. That's tasty, man. Yeah, so the reason why we got it, and I wouldn't normally get it, but I follow Duncan on Instagram, and every time they announce something cool, like something new that's coming, my mind is like, oh my gosh, the, the those refreshers look so good, or oh my gosh, the Charlie 2.0, the cloud, or whatever. I'm like, that's so exciting. Then you go to the comments, and everyone's like, no one asked for this. Yeah. We want butter pecan. When are you gonna bring back butter pecan? 
again. What are, I'm, I'm like, oh my, oh my god. god, like salty. So when they brought it back, I needed to try it because apparently people are outraged that butter pecan, it wasn't back or whatever. And then so they announced on their Instagram and they announced that it was coming back. I was like, finally, people are probably really, people are probably really excited that it's back. And so then I go to the comments and the primary comments are, make it year round make butter pecan year round. And it was just like, no one is happy ever. Like it is so frustrating. Just be happy with what you get. Gosh darn it. Overall, I would say it's very delicious. I would say if you like hazelnut in that nutty type of flavor, you would really like this. You like nutting? Do you like nuts? Baby. Sorry, family friendly vlog. Okay, hold on. If you like hazelnuts, if you like pecans, if you like peanuts, and you'll mix it with milk and coffee, you're gonna like this drink, okay? Okay. It's really good. It's really good. It's really good. I thought you said we were gonna go get cat food. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god. We'll get it after. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> we're doing some errands. We'll see you guys later. I got a one track. I'm hungry. I think that's what it is. My brain gets so foggy when I'm hungry. I'm gonna get a poke bowl from Market Basket. <laughs> Yeah, it's so good. I'm I got get a, a deli sandwich. I got a poke bowl last time and I wasn't actually expecting too much and then it actually ended up being really freaking good. Dude, you know, Market Basket just does it right. I know. Market Basket. Market Basket, we love you. Like, if anyone is We love you. If anyone is so confused what Market Basket is, imagine you just your grocery go. store. Yeah. But it is a local family-owned chain. Yeah that's big enough to where it's grown out of its originating state and gone up and down the east coast. Mm -hmm. They are so friendly, their prices are reasonable, yeah. and, and it's just good stuff. I was like describing, I was like, I think I fell in love with a grocery store when I like went to Market Basket for the first time when we moved back here. And I was like, Jack, everyone's just so nice. And like, yeah. they keep the, the shelves stocked and like the prices are ridiculously reasonable and everyone is so friendly. It's my grocery store, and he was like, yeah, that's awesome. That's awesome but then you went for the first time <laughs> what this guy just got dusted <laughs> he got dusted by a, a truck and he's pissed now he's trained <laughs> tailing the truck with the with a guy who's towing a lawnmower yeah, oh my gosh that was so funny there's this car that's like all souped up and he's like making all these sounds on the road oh. like vroom vroom and then this guy it's not souped up that's i'm sorry funny. i'm no, sorry no, no. i'm sorry i didn't mean to explain i apologize Man's can I paint the picture? Yes, you can paint the picture. There is a guy who put a sticker and tinted windows and like has a different color, you know, trunk or whatever. They make their cars look fast, but they're not. But they're not. And... <laughs> He's so pissed. He has a fart can, a muffler to make his sound, his car sound. Oh my God, and he cut in front. He's just so mad yeah. that this old geezer with a trailer on the back of his car beat him at a race. Oh my gosh, I'll never understand the male species sometimes. If I'm, being ego if, I'm, if I'm being completely honest, the ego, I'll never understand. Oh, Hi friends, it is Monday, just real quick, because Jack has to get back to work. He just got back from the dentist. Oh, yeah, Getting all his teeth clean. Shout out Alex. Shout out Alex. Hi Alex. Lauren, on a, one of the last vlogs that we were trying to do the duvet cover and saw that we were very stressed, commented and said, We? <laughs> We were very stressed, weren't we? We were very stressed. She was like, How why are you be? doing that that way? And she like described a different way to do a duvet cover because this is not, this is just no way to live. This is no way to live. I guess there's a different way. I can't really describe it, but it does seem with two people it would be much easier. So before we were doing the whole burrito rolling method and then flipping out and like turning it into, <laughs> not, not the way to go. So let's go ahead and try our hand at this way. Okay, hi. The idea is that, okay, so we flip this inside out. Yes. We're going to flip this inside out? We're going to, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna flip this inside out. Be careful, last time you, you ripped it. No, you ripped it last time, Bob. All right, this is inside out. Is it though? All right. Okay, okay, so which side is the end? Uh, this is the end, button side. Button side is the end? Yeah. Okay, so what you're gonna do, the idea. I'm so nervous. No, 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 no. I think, That's I just, I'm not a very visual person. No, 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 no. So you're gonna reach in and just like go up and- Oh, I'm envisioning now. See, okay, see. so you're gonna grab that 
And if you could, can you reach across the up to the other side and do this one as well? And just I'm like Jack Duvet hands. Duvet hands. Okay. Arriba. And then Do you know what I'm trying to like? Yeah, I'm gonna grab the corners and then yank it. And then I, I can help bring down the duvet cover like on top of it, if that makes sense. Boy. But it could be a lot better. So I see what happens, what Lauren did. If I mess up, it's all my fault. <laughs> you just get mad at me. Yeah, okay. And then I can help go like this. Just don't let go of the duvet up I'm here. A this is a great demo, they just see my back. <laughs> you have no idea what's going on. <laughs> Sorry guys, you'll see the end product. Okay, so don't let go of the end of say it. the duvet. Say it out loud. No, say it. Don't let I'm go of Jack. I'm a vampire. Oh. Don't ever let go of Jack. I'm a vampire. What is that? Twilight, say it. Say it out loud. <laughs> no. Okay. Jack Crow. It's the Titanic. I'm so then, let's go like this. I let go. Well, you took it from get me. your corner. Make sure you have it. And let, let's just pull it up. And then... Pull it to the, pull it over. We're gonna just like even it out now. That was so much better. <laughs> Thanks, Lauren. Wow, that was awesome. I know. I've never seen Dingle smile or laugh <laughs> at the end of a duvet <laughs> cover thing. It's it. Yeah, that was impressive. If anyone else has any duvet techniques they want to try, we are now a duvet cover channel. Because we're so good at demoing what we just did. We really couldn't see anything. Yeah. If you guys could really figure it out, I'll leave I'll leave the demo that Lauren sent me down below because that's much better. I'm out. Thanks, Bob. I'm here all week. <laughs> guys, I touched on this in the video where I talked about the purple mattress. What has made our bed go from like something that was just so kind of uncomfortable. Also, I'm so sorry about like the state of myself right now. It is Monday and I have not gotten ready. I've done an out workout and that's it. But I did touch on this when I was specifically like going into depth about like the purple mattress, but also just like why our bed is so freaking comfortable now. It has everything to do with the fact that we went basically all linen on our bed. Our sheet like those reddish type of burnt red sheets are so freaking breathable, <laughs> so breathable and so nice. As well as this duvet cover. We got it for Christmas, but I will leave it linked down below along with the sheets. They're definitely a pretty penny to spend, but we have never felt so good about investing in ourselves before and in good sleeping conditions. They, It's so good. We were sleeping at my parents' house Saturday into Sunday for Mother's Day, and I used to love that bed. And and it's good, but like getting used to our sheets and how breathable they are, I was like, the temperature was all off. I was too hot with the blankets on. I was too cold with them off. I couldn't get comfortable. They was just not breathable. So last night was the first night back in our own bed after Mother's Day and I slept like an actual baby. Like I cannot reiterate enough how important it is to treat yourself to good bedding. <laughs>